Uh, the wings were great. They were uh, really uh, nice, tender, juicy. And the Maui ribs were spectacular. Very tender, very flavorful. And the food is really good. I ordered the pub burger and it was, uh, it was really good. Well, the atmosphere is great. There's lots of people, lots of uh, great conversation. Just really friendly, low key, nice atmosphere. Today I'm visiting a restaurant pub called the Toad and Turtle. This is a stunning two level restaurant that serves some of the freshest, most delicious foods you've ever tried. And they have that amazing pub atmosphere you love. Let's go check it out. Food is delicious and service is excellent, excellent, excellent. They're very high-end pub, they have great drinks. I love the atmosphere, the people, the regulars, the staff. Their pizza crust is one of the best that i found. Yeah. It's crispy, it's tender, got lots of toppings, really great. How was it? Tell it me was how... delicious. You can tell it's empty, it's gone. Yeah. It's good. <laughs> what was your favorite part of the dish? Uh, I, I like some... the little riblings. These, yeah, they the were little, good. Oh, the Maui ribs? Yep, they were delicious. Okay, Val, what do we have in front of us here? I see we got like tons of meat and stuff for a marinade, is that right? Correct. All right, well, what are we doing? All right, well, Maui ribs, uh, one of our best, most popular sellers. Ooh, Maui ribs. Maui ribs. Sounds good. Oh. <laughs> You're making me hungry already. <laughs> There's this mountain of deliciousness that we have right here. We call it our Aziki rub. Um, mm. It, it's specially formulated for us, uh, our owner Paul Thomason. He worked on this for many years. He had uh, he had something similar to this in Hawaii, I believe it was, way back in the okay. day. Okay. Um, so is this a special recipe? This here, is then? a special recipe. They worked on this for years. Wow. To perfect it. Well, the Maui ribs are a unique item for us. Spent a lot of time trying to perfect the recipe. For us, it's it's a lot of fresh ingredients, and we marinate uh, prime rib bones that are cut and we marinate the minimum 72 hours before we'll sell them. Uh, that gives a great marination process, uh, puts a lot of the flavor of the marinade in the product, and uh, I think they're one of the best products out there. Okay, so what's our first step here? We're gonna put... Water. Ah, uh, water. Oh, that smells good. And uh, what exactly are we putting in now? Sherry. Sherry? Sherry. Oh, Val is very strong to do this all the time, and uh, here goes nothing. Aloha! Look at that. Uh, let's let these babies sit for 72 hours. I'll meet you at the grill. So now we're going to be cooking our Maui ribs. Take a look at that. This is, uh, this is gorgeous. Look at that. It does not get better than this. This is just... This is happy food right here. Oh my goodness, this is awesome. I cannot wait to dive into this dish. Shall we? We shall. Let's do it now, look at that. Wow. Oh. Wow. This is just amazing. The flavors, you take your first bite, it's just bursting full of flavor. There's a little bit of heat to it, nice and sweet. But really, it's kind of tough to describe. It's kind of one of those you gotta, you just gotta come in and try it for yourself. It's just, it's just awesome. Very delicious. The Maui ribs are awesome. Juicy, tender, very tasty. Excellent. Very tasty. I had the Maui ribs and they were fantastic. Mm. Nice and sweet. It has uh, pineapple flavor. The yes. Maui ribs are amazing. They're juicy. They got just enough heat. Good barbecue. I mean, they are really awesome. You're making me hungry. <laughs> I think I'm gonna want some I'll more Maui. <laughs> You're too kind, thank you. <laughs> Food here is very fresh. We make our own pizza dough. We make our own sauces. We make our own gravies. It's not out of package. We, we smoke our own meats. Um, so it, it, everything is as fresh as fresh can be. And it's so refreshing for a pub to have that quality. Now, what are we gonna be making? Today we're making Yorkshire puddings. Yorkshire puddings. Val, I'm seeing some awesome looking ingredients here. Uh, what exactly uh, do we have here? Is this? Just milk. Milk. Eggs, flour, and a little bit of salt. They're so incredibly simple. Okay, awesome. Well, I can't wait to see this. Why don't we go ahead and start making this? All right. So now what's our next step? We're gonna go ahead and throw this on a hot, oily pan? Yes, sir. We're gonna walk down the line. All right, let's do it. 
go ahead and do this and make All these right. Yorkies. So perfect. Wow! Look at that! Oh my goodness! Look how beautiful those look. It is now time to build up our delicious looking mini Yorkies. What is the next step for our mini Yorkies? Well, we're gonna top them with some homemade gravy. Oh, mmm, gravy. What are we doing now? We're gonna give it a little squirt. The horseradish sauce. Okay, what? Well, no, let, let's, you gotta show me how you do it here. Okay, let, let's see all it. Right. Oh, yeah. Oh, just a little, little bit on just each one. Just a little bit. Okay. I was gonna go nuts and put it all over there. Oh, no, there we go. <laughs> okay, perfect. Oh my goodness. This is awesome. I cannot wait to try this. Now ah, you gotta join me here. Come on, grab the fork. Alrighty. Let's do it. Cheers, Cheers to you. Oh yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Well, I almost just passed out here. That is so delicious. Yeah. Full of flavor. The Yorkie, uh, incredibly soft, fluffy, and then that smoked meat, nice and salty, and uh, that gravy is killer. Man, this is a delicious dish. The food here, the toad and turtle, is great. Uh, biggest reason I believe that is is that we use fresh ingredients. Uh, we don't use a lot of things that are deep fried. We don't we don't use many products that are out of a box. We make everything from scratch. We have sous chefs, Red Seal chefs. Uh, we do everything by hand, and we believe the quality of the food is what makes people come back. Uh, gives them a good experience when they come to the Toad and Turtle, and that's what we want to provide. That's what we hang our hat on. Now we're going to be smoking some meat. So Val, what exactly, what cut do we have here? It's pork shoulder butt. What we're going to use our Sunshine Sexy Rub. We're just going to take a little bit, sprinkle some on. Well, take a look at this. We just rubbed our amazing cut of meat. Now, this thing is huge. So now, what are we gonna do? We're gonna put it in the smoker. We're gonna put it in the smoker? Mm -hmm. All right, let's do it. Okay, so now we're gonna take out our pork shoulder bud. We're gonna pull some pork. Okay, so now I see some beautiful looking ingredients in front of us. Val, what are we gonna be making? Pulled pork poutine. So what's our first step here? Well, we're just gonna put a little bit of french fries on the cast iron. Ooh, very nice. These are lightly seasoned with our secret seasoning salt. <laughs> I can't quite tell you what exactly that is. It's just good, is. it just tastes good. <laughs> then we're gonna put the cheese grits on. You wanna put a few more french fries on there? Oh yeah, yeah, for sure. And then on, oh, so we layer it basically. Yeah, we're gonna layer this. Ooh, that's smart, very nice. Well, you don't wanna get all the way to the bottom and have no curds absolutely, left. Absolutely, absolutely. Then we're so gonna looking just, good there, and then just dump it full of cheese. Oh my goodness. This we is... want this to be nice and gooey and lovely. <laughs> I love cheese curds and I love fries. Basically then we're just gonna take our pulled pork that yeah. we pulled. Uh, we added just a little bit of barbecue sauce to it. Ooh, very nice. Just a little bit. Just for that hint of flavor. Yeah, and then this is our homemade pork gravy. Oh, wow. We're just gonna slather that on. That is It's a... going to get a little messy. It's gonna come out on the wood a little bit. That's, That's okay. Okay. <laughs> it's all going to the same spot. <laughs> oh, that is that is wow. I, I'm that. speechless. That is just that is just so beautiful and delicious. Mm -hmm. Oh, the smell is just incredible. So, should we go ahead and give this a little bite? I think we should. Yeah. Wow. Look at that. I want to get a, a little bite of the uh, oh, yeah. pork on there. Oh. That is heavenly. The nice light flavoring of the barbecue on the pork, the fresh potato, the fresh French fry, uh, nice and soft with that gravy, and then uh, that's that's a tasty dish. Oh, that's great. That's one of the best poutines I've ever tried. Thank that's you. Good. <laughs> good job. I had a phenomenal visit today at the Toad and Turtle. All the food we made was fresh and delicious. Now it's time for me to hit the road. Thanks for watching.